In this uh, tutorial, we will look at the term shear modulus. Uh, shear modulus is defined as the ratio of shearing stress to shearing strain. So we have an object here, and if we apply a certain force tangentially to the top surface, the object will experience a certain amount of torsion. And as we see in this uh, diagram, we can label uh, some of the changes that occur due to that application of the tangential force that the angle of deformation is gamma and that is caused by shear uh, because of that tangential force applied to the top surface. Note that the height of that object was y and the movement of the top surface from its initial location is x. So a shearing strain is then expressed as the movement x of the top surface based on the height that is y. So it is x over y. We can convert that x over y into tangent gamma. So let's see how we get uh, x over y equals tangent gamma. Uh, we have a uh, right angle triangle here. Uh, we have x and y, and uh, the angle is gamma. Uh, so if we just uh, turn this uh, triangle around, uh, note that x over y uh, will equal tangent gamma. The shear stress on this object can be expressed with the symbol tau, a Greek letter tau, that equals the force, F, divided by the area of the top surface, A. So shear modulus is expressed by a symbol G, where G equals shear stress over shear strain, and that equals tau for shear stress, divided by tangent gamma for shear strain. For a small change in the angle gamma, tangent gamma is approximately equal to gamma. So we can express G, the shear modulus, as tau over gamma. Note that shear modulus is a measure of how a material will bend or twist upon the application of shear stress. Sometimes shear modulus is referred to as the rigidity of the material. So in summary, we note that shear modulus is obtained by shear stress and shear strain, and that is due to the application of the tangential force acting on the top surface that causes that shear strain uh, as expressed by uh, tangent gamma. And that allows us to obtain the value of shear modulus.